Hello students, welcome to our lesson number one. Chicos, el video que ustedes están viendo es para comenzar a trabajar las unidades de tercero básico. Para eso necesito que estén con su copybook, cuaderno, pencil case, estuche y Tiger Time 3, activity book and student book, sus dos libros de Tiger Time. Cuando tengan que realizar una actividad en su copybook o en su Tiger Time y necesiten tiempo extra, Solamente deben colocar pausa en este video y cuando estén ready, colocan play nuevamente. Ok, ¿Are you ready to start unit 1? Yes, very good. Unit 1 is about activities we do. ¿Qué serán las activities we do? Mm -hmm. Let's see. What I do. Here we have a video of children from England and these kids tell us what they do in their free time en este caso en su tiempo libre so today I have a challenge for you el desafío número uno in your copy book you are going to write down all the activities you hear in the video todas las actividades que tú entiendes del video las vas a anotar si las quieres escribir en Spanish, it's okay, don't worry. Para ver el video, vas a ir a YouTube and you are going to write Kids, what do you do in your spare time or at weekends? And you click play in the video, ¿ok? Puedes ver el video cuantas veces necesites para tener tus ideas. Cuando estés ready, let's check your answers. Let's see your answers. Kids tell us um, different activities they do. For example, play football, use a computer, making comics, cooking with mom, play with the dog, go shopping, play tennis, playing in the garden, play board games, sleep over, go swimming, watch TV, and listen to music. ¿Pero se dan cuenta de que yo no mencioné algunas activities? Ok. Challenge 2. El desafío 2 es... En Google Classroom voy a escribir un post en donde ustedes tendrán que responder la pregunta. Which activities I didn't include in the PowerPoint presentation? ¿Cuáles son las actividades que no incluí en la presentación de PowerPoint? Ok. Según el video que acaban de ver. Ok. So, let's continue. Now I'm going to tell you my activities. Miss Mariana and her activities. I play games. See, I'm a winner. I listen to music. Bruno Mars, I love him. I don't watch films. Oh, me quedo dormida rápidamente. I use a computer. I go on excursions. I take photos. I help people with alcohol health. Oh, I'm a good painter. I paint pictures. Mm, I don't make things. I'm a disaster. I do sports. See? Practicing yoga. Okay, now open your copy book and write objective. Identificar las actividades cotidianas que realizo. Luego, unit one and the title, a computer for the club. And pay attention, here we have a box. Tenemos un pequeño recuadro que dice, things we do equals common actions. O sea que las acciones comunes que hacemos es lo mismo que las cosas que realizamos. ¿Okay? Si necesitas tiempo para escribir esto, pon pausa en el video y cuando estés ready, colocas play again. ¿Okay? So now, open your student's book, page number five. Here we have the four members of the Tiger Street Club. And they are telling us what are we going to study in Unit 1. Okay, nos van a explicar qué vamos a aprender en esta unidad. So let's listen to them. 
Here we go. In Unit 1, we read a story about a thief in Tiger Street. We learn about computers and do a fun quiz. We find out about how children in the UK use computers. We talk about what we do. Okay. We already started with this part. Talk about what we do. Ya empezamos con esta parte. Hablar sobre lo que hacemos. And what we do. ¿Qué es lo que hacemos? These activities. Now, I'm going to mention the activities and then you have to repeat. Para repetir después de mí, te sugiero que coloques pausa en el video. Ok. Después de cada actividad. So, let's start. Play games. Listen to music. Watch films. Use a computer. Go on excursions. Take photos. Help people. Paint pictures. Make things. Do sports. Si quieres escuchar nuevamente para repetir, retrocede unos segundos el video y las vuelves a escuchar. Ok. So now, let's go back to your copybook. Volvemos a nuestro cuaderno. Activity 1. In your copybook, draw and color the following activities. Ok. The same activities we already mentioned in the student's book. Son las mismas actividades que acabamos de mencionar en nuestro student's book. Here we have the 10 activities. Para dibujar y colorear, si necesitas el tiempo necesario, coloca pausa en este video y cuando estés ready, colocas play again. Ok, so start drawing and coloring. Puedes comenzar. Ok, now you finish, let's go back to the book. But now, go back to the activity book. Page number 5, activity 1. Look, read and write. Here we have the same 10 activities but pay attention they are not complete you have to complete with these words from the box for example number one play play what play computer play people no play games so that's why the example is play games okay so now you have to continue with the other activities when you finish we check Ok, let's check. Let's see. Listen to music, watch films, use a computer, go on excursions, take photos, help people, paint pictures, make things. Do sports. Si tiene las mismas respuestas que yo, veremos ahora si estamos right or wrong. Here we go. Yes, very good. We did it. Perfect. Activity number two. Listen a number and write. Here we have four kids. Tenemos cuatro chicos. Cada uno está haciendo una different activity. Pero fíjense que nuevamente no están completas. Vamos a escuchar lo que cada uno de ellos está haciendo y vamos a escribir el number en el orden en que aparece. Ok, pay attention. Number, number one. one. I draw pictures. Number two. I write stories. Number three. I read books. Number four. I sing songs. Ok. If you need to listen to one more time, retrocede unos segundos este video para escucharlo nuevamente si lo necesitas. If you are ready, let's check. Here we go. The answers. These are the answers. Very good. Are you okay? ¿Estuvieron correctos? Perfect, congratulations. 
activity number three. Look and write. Here we have four activities, but only number one is ready. Here we have a boy taking a bus and he says, I go on excursions. What about number two and this girl? What about number three and this little girl with her mom? And what about number four with this boy? If you need help, si necesitas ayuda, te puedes apoyar de tu copybook con las, las activities que dibujaste o con la page number five de tu student book. Okay? Esta activity we are going to check next lesson. La vamos a revisar en la próxima clase. Por mientras, para terminar, te tengo una invitación. Pay attention. I know you love playing games. Yo sé que les gusta jugar mucho. Por eso les tenemos. Are you good playing memory? Vas a copiar este link en Google Classroom y te va a aparecer esta imagen. It's a memory game. Y este memory game is the free time activities. So let's start. For example, okay. No. Yes, I did it. The rest is your turn. El resto le corresponde a ustedes. Okay. So, the lesson is over. La clase de hoy ha terminado. Para la próxima oportunidad, les recuerdo que tienen que estar con su copybook, pencil case, and tiger time three. Okay.